So all I'm interested in doing in this video is I want to go from the original LP problem into the initial tableau. Okay, that's all I'm going to do. I'm not going to do any uh, iterations of the simplex algorithm. It's just can we go straight from this into the initial tableau. So we're going to maximize 3x take away y take away z subject to x plus 2y plus 5z is less than or equal to 200. x plus y plus z is greater than or equal to 10. x is greater than or equal to 1. y is greater than or equal to 2. z is greater than or equal to 5. Okay, so the first thing is that with maximizing 3x take away y take away z, that is equal to p. And so I'm going to move everything onto one side of the equation to get equal 0 on the right-hand side. So I would have p equals that, take 3x from both sides, add the y to both sides, add the z to both sides is equal to 0. Right, then we have this constraint. Now, because it's less than or equal to, I must add in a slack variable to pick up that slack. So x plus 2y plus 5z plus s1 is going to be equal to 200. So I'm going to add on the slack variable to bring me up to 200. Then I've got this one, x plus y plus z is greater than or equal to 10. So for that, I've got x plus y plus z. Now, because it's greater than or equal to, I need to subtract a surplus variable and add on an artificial variable. OK. Then for this constraint, because it's greater than or equal to 1, I must subtract a surplus variable and add on an artificial variable to make it equal to 1. And then for y is greater than or equal to 2, I must subtract a surplus variable and add on an artificial variable. So that's equal to 2. And for z is greater than or equal to 5, I must have z take away a surplus variable plus an artificial variable is equal to 5. Now, at some point, I need to write down uh, that I, what these new variables are and what they are. So I'm going to write down here that S1 is a slack variable. OK, where S1 is greater than or equal to 0. Uh, then we've got S2, S3, S4, S5. So S2, S3, S4, S5 are surplus variables. Uh, where we've got S2 is greater than or equal to 0, S3 is greater than or equal to 0, S4 is greater than or equal to 0, and S5 is greater than or equal to 0. And we've also got uh, A1, A2, A3, A4. So A1, A2, A3, A4 are artificial variables. Where A1 is greater than or equal to 0, a2 is greater than or equal to 0, a3 is greater than or equal to 0, and a4 is greater than or equal to 0. OK, so that covers my back in defining the variables. Now, the only thing that we haven't got yet is capital A, OK, which is the sum of a1, a2, a3, and a4. So capital A is the sum of the artificial variables. OK, now what I'm going to do is I'm going to add together the four equations that I have that involve a1, a2, a3, a4. So that's all of those. Add them all together. OK, so what I'm going to get is x plus x, so 2x. I've got a y plus a y, so 2y. And I've got a z plus a z, so 2z. I've got uh, minus S2, minus S3, minus S4, minus S5. And I've got A1, A2, A3, A4 added together. So that's capital A. And that's going to be equal to 10, 11, 13, 18. OK. Now, you want to write the A really at the start. So I'm just going to move that over there. And so now... I have my equations that I need to put into my initial tableau 
for the two-stage simplex. So I'm going to have A, P, X, Y, Z. Then I've got S1, S2, S3, S4, uh, and S5. And I've got A1, I'm going to run out of space, A1, A2, A3, A4, and a right-hand side. So quite a lot of variables in this one. Probably a good job that I'm not doing uh, any of the iterations. Um, you can get Excel to do that if you like. Uh, OK, so let's run through that one at the top. So we've got 1, 0 Ps, then we've got 2, 2, 2, uh, 0, minus 1, minus 1, minus 1, minus 1. Uh, and that's equal to 18, so 0, 0, 0, 0, 18. Right, then we've got this one. So 0, 1, minus 3, 1, 1, and the rest are zeros. Then we've got this one here. So 0, 0, we've got 1, 2, 5, then uh, 1, then the rest are zeros, and the right hand side is 200. Then we've got this one, so 0, 0, 1, 1, 1, uh, 0, minus 1, uh, then 0, 0, 0, 1, 0, 0, 0, 10. Right, then we've got this one here, so that's 0, 0, 1, then we've just got S3, so minus 1, and we've got A2. OK, and that's going to be equal to 1. Then we've got this one, so 0, 0, 0, 1, 0, 0, 0, 0, then minus 1 for S4, uh, 0, 0, 0, then 1 for A3, uh, 0, 2. And then the last one, 0, 0, 0, 0, 1, uh, 0, 0, 0, 0, minus 1, 0, 0, 0, 1, and then 5. Okay, uh, so that is my initial tableau for this uh, LP problem, okay, which would be using the two-stage uh, two simplex algorithm method. Okay, so that is just setting up the tableau. I'm not going to go through any iterations of that um, because it's just going to be too many numbers uh, that I have to deal with on the board.